Oh, hey guys, it's your girl Sammy here, back at it again with another Roblox video, and in today's video, I am going to be decorating my house for Christmas on Bloxburg. So I am so, so excited. But anyways, as you can see, I am baking some Christmas cookies, or I guess you could say holiday cookies, to get in the Christmas spirit, and I thought this was a perfect way to start off the intro. But we're gonna go ahead and place these cookies on the table i really am crossing my fingers that i can eat them i'm so happy let's go ahead and turn on the sound you guys probably can't hear it but if you can that's good um but anyways okay so let's go ahead and take another portion i'll just save three cookies for whoever comes to my house and wants some holiday cookies so i'll just leave those over here but as you guys can see my house doesn't have anything christmasy um, other than this globe, I had this from last year, and that's basically the only Christmassy thing that I have in my house. Okay, so let's go ahead and click on the mailbox and start building. So, so for this first part, I will talk, but for the rest, I'll just speed it up so that you guys are just sitting here watching me talk, because I don't think you guys want to see that. I'm pretty sure you just want to see me decorate. I don't know, but either way, you guys will get like half and half. Okay, so let's go ahead and go to new and start adding some stuff. So what I really want to add is one of these wreaths. So I'm going to add the illuminated one. And I think I'm going to add this probably over here. <gasps> I can't add it. Hold on, maybe. Oh, there you go. It was going like through the wall. That was very confusing. I really like that actually. So I'm going to leave that there. I might delete it after. I'm not sure. Why do I still have a hay bale over here? I'm not sure about that. Um, and we're also going to change this to white to blend in with the snow just a little bit. So we'll do that. And we're going to delete the mushrooms. Oh wait, not the tree, not the tree. Let me go back. Not the tree, I want to delete like all the flowers and stuff because that's more, you know, summer based. It doesn't have much to do with winter because, you know, there's no flowers growing in winter. Oh, there's also a pumpkin hiding in the trash. What is that doing here? <laughs> okay, so yeah, there is a pumpkin hiding in there. But I think we're all good for all the Halloween stuff, so... Actually, there's some pumpkins inside, so let me just go ahead and get that out of the way and delete that. Okay, so now we have something to work with. So we are going to add... I don't think I'm going to add any lights because my house is really weird and the roofs just don't allow me to place lights all the way up here, which is kind of annoying. A reindeer. Yes, I need to place this. I'm going to place this right over here. Yes, right over here there is a snowman. So I'm going to add this right beside the reindeer. So they can become really good friends. So now that I have those two decorations, I'm going to start with the outdoor if you couldn't already tell. Um, but what else should I add? <sighs> yes, the inflatable holiday penguin. I totally need to add this. I think I'll add this right over here actually. Right there. And we'll change the colors afterwards, but I think I'll leave them for now. And we'll also move this a little bit up. And also this. Okay, I think that looks a little bit better. Oh yeah, one of those candy canes, the huge candy cane. We need to add this right over here. And it's kind of tilted, so we'll kind of move that over. The colors look a little bit weird right now because, I mean, it doesn't look weird, but it's really bright. And my house is supposed to be kind of like, um, very soft colors, I guess. So I don't want super bright colors, but I'm probably going to go like with a blue theme for Christmas, a blue and white theme. So that's what I'm going to base my house and decorations off of like blue and white that's the scheme okay so i'm not sure if i should add one of these i don't know if you can really even see it i can't really even see it so i don't think i'm gonna add that i think that's actually it for the outdoor i don't know what else to add so i think that's gonna be it for the outdoor i don't want to add any of these trees because again i don't want to make it look super crowded i'm not sure if i said that but I don't want it to look super crowded, so I think that's all I'm going to add. So let's go ahead and start changing the colors. So I think I'm going to change the color of the present. So I'm going to make this white. As I said, I'm going off of a white and blue theme. So I'm not sure what kind of blue I want. Definitely not a dark blue. I want it to be a very soft blue. So maybe something like this. Or maybe even that. Hmm. What do you guys think? I really like this. Oh, even this looks really good, but I think I might go with either this or this. I like this. Just for now, we'll go with that. And then we'll also change the candy cane 
to that same blue. All right. And yeah, I think that looks actually really, really good. I'm actually really liking it. I think I should probably add another snowman. So let's add one right beside the penguin so that the penguin can have some company as well. We'll add that right there. Oh, that's actually so cute. I think that is actually it for the outdoors because I don't want to add um, a whole lot of stuff. So yeah, that's going to be it for the outdoors. But I think... There's one thing I'm missing, and I'm not sure where that is. Oh, it's actually right here, the dirt pile. We can make snow with this, guys. So we're going to add a couple of dirt piles just right over here so that we can kind of pretend that they're snow piles. And it still says saving failed, which is honestly not too good because I don't want to have this whole place decorated and then not have it save. So I really hope that it does save. But okay. Let's rotate this a little bit. Do, 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 do. Okay, I think that's pretty good. Um, I'll go ahead and put that... Where should I put this? Probably just right there. But we need to get the perfect color for the snow. And the perfect texture, not the perfect color. The perfect texture. Oh, I think I found it. It's just the... Is it the default one, basically? I think that's what it is. So, we are going to do that. I think that looks so so good oh my gosh i almost passed it <laughs> so okay so i just went ahead and changed that and that and that looks so good i love that so much already but i think we are ready to move on to the inside so i already know kind of what i want to add so i was thinking we can add a bunch of gingerbread men all throughout the house so i'm going to add one over here i've always wanted to add something and this is the perfect time to so that looks perfect over there also add one in the corner there's gonna be so many so if you guys can count how many gingerbread men are um in my house in total so oh my gosh no it's still saying saving failed that is not a good thing for me because if this doesn't save, that is not going to be very good. We got the, I think, five gingerbread men or one, two, three, four, five. Yeah, I have five. So yeah, we got five gingerbread men over there. And I think I'll also delete this and add a snow globe because I only had one or two snow globes from last year that I got saved into my inventory. So now we can finally add another one right over here. Perfect, love that. And I think I might also add one of the miniature holiday trees right over here as well. Let's see how that looks from a far distance. I don't really like that to be honest, so I'm not gonna add that right there. I probably will just add, what should I add? Oh, the snowflakes. I totally forgot about the snowflakes. I can add a couple of snowflakes outside. So I'll add them, I'll add one right here as well, um, on the side of the house, we'll just have them all going in a row, or at least like that. Yes, this is going to make it look so much better. Alright guys, the angles are a little bit off because this is just how I build, so it's a little bit weird, but yeah. All right, so those are all for the snowflakes. I don't think I'll add any inside. Oh, yes, I need to add some more gingerbread men. I was thinking of adding one right over here in the middle of the two windows. I think that looks really cute. So we're going to add it right there. And there was something I wanted to add here because as you can see, it's very boring and there's nothing in this corner. So maybe I can add a Christmas tree here. I'm really thinking I should. But which one should I add? This one is definitely not going to go there. That's really small. <gasps> Wait, maybe I can add one of the illuminated ones. Maybe I can add one. That's, that's the small version. I want the bigger version. I'm definitely adding this here. This looks so good. Okay, so what angle looks the best? I think this kind of looks the best, in my opinion. So we're going to add that right over there. Oh my gosh, I love it. I actually love that. It's so cute. Um, okay, so I already have a snow globe. Why do I still have pumpkins? I thought I got rid of all of them, but apparently not. Okay, so maybe I should add... Oh, stockings. I totally forgot about that, but maybe we should add the... 
the mantle decor the stocking mantle decor okay so we'll add that right there love that so cute i almost forgot one of the most important things a gingerbread house how could i forget that where even is it it's right over here a gingerbread house i should probably add it over here and we're going to rotate it so this is going to take a lot of rotating but it's all right I wish you could actually kind of like eat off parts of it. That would be so cute and so fun. Okay, I think that's the perfect angle. So we'll add that right there. Love that so much. So now I'm going to speed up the rest of the video. I think I've been talking a little bit too much. I don't want you guys to get bored throughout this video. So I'm going to speed the rest of it up. Put some nice, fun, cheerful Christmas music in the background and continue building. Okay guys, so after a long time of building, it honestly feels like hours and hours that I've been building for. I'm not sure when I started, but it's been a long time. But so far, this is what the house looks like. I don't like the wreath right there, so I'm actually going to go ahead and delete that. I don't really like the wreath at all, so it's kind of, it's a little bit distracting. So we're just going to delete that quickly, um, but there you go. So this is what the house looks like and i think it looks amazing and i'm just so excited to show you guys so as you guys saw if you did watch the full video i changed the the front mailbox and the trash bags to a trash can i think it looks a lot better um so i really really like that and then i also of course had to add the inflatable penguin and the thing that i really like about this is look how cool this will look so basically what you can do Wait, how come I can't make a snowball? Oh, there you go. I think I can't make it when I'm on that, but basically this looks so cool. It looks like you're kind of grabbing it from this pile of snow. You can basically throw the snowball and have like little fun snowball fights. And I also added a bunch of snowflakes to the side 
Oh my gosh, the snowman's butt is sticking out of the- Okay, I gotta go ahead <laughs> and fix that right now, and I'll be right back once again. Okay, so now the snowman's booty should not be- Okay, <laughs> the snowman's butt is not poking out, so that's all good. And then we also have a snowman over here. Little snowman, I love it. And then, of course, the penguin, as I said. And then, I don't really like the mailbox too much, but I'll probably ch end up changing it after. I just don't like the colors. I think that's why. I just don't like the colors. I'm not used to the colors yet. Um, so, I don't really like that too much. But if we back up, you can see how the house looks from far. I didn't go too over the top with this. I mostly added a lot of decorations on the inside and not too much on the outside. But anyways, we have some more uh, piles of snow, um, I guess you could say. And then we also have a little reindeer and we also have another snowman and we have a gigantic candy cane over there again i changed the colors of most of the things but that's what that looks like and now for the grand opening well not really a grand opening but you guys get the point let's go ahead and reveal what the inside looks like i know you guys already saw but you didn't get to see well i didn't really get to see it that well so there are a lot of gingerbread men i probably will end up deleting them um but comment down below how many gingerbread men you think there are in the house i'm definitely gonna go ahead and delete some because i think i have a little bit too many in my house not gonna lie i kind of went a little bit overboard with all of them but i still think they look really cute like i don't know you can never have too many gingerbread men so i decided to add a lot and then i also added a poinsettia right there which is like a plant and then i added a snow globe in there i didn't add anything in here because i mean what possibly could you add in this little closet nothing much and i didn't add anything to the garage which i probably will end up adding like a snowman in the corner or something like that so yeah you guys will see that in the future if i do ever make a roblox roleplay um or bloxburg roleplay comment down below if you want to see a roleplay by the way because i'd totally be willing to make a roleplay um but yeah so this is what my kitchen looks like i literally love it i kind of don't really like how the icicles look over here so i'm probably gonna end up deleting that but other than that i really like it we have the gingerbread house over here love that it looks so delicious let me just say i want to eat it so bad right now um but let's just go ahead and eat some grapes okay so i just went ahead and ate the grapes so i'm feeling a lot better now um but over here we have a snowman love that i keep saying love that oh my gosh i need to stop saying that i need to think of something better to say i need a better vocabulary um and i also have the decor over here for the fireplace the stocking decor and then i have one of the illuminated or spiral uh, I don't know what they're called, but I have one of these trees. I didn't want to get one of the actual ones because I don't know. I just wanted to get something very simple, but also very glamorous. So I have that. And then I have um, a lot of gingerbread men throughout this whole entire house. You will definitely see a lot. And then I added one of the new log chairs. I really like the way that it looks and it looks very nice and cozy. And then I added one of the mini miniature nutcrackers over there and i also have a bunch of icicle lights i also have some more holiday cookies i'm gonna take one more because i'm a little bit hungry again um but now we're going to move on to the office one of my favorite parts another gingerbread man oh my gosh i cannot believe how many i have but when you step up in the office as you can see there's not much decorations in here i kind of wanted to make it a little bit simple but i did add one of the new lamps which i'm super happy about we'll go ahead and leave that on actually and then i have a jumbo nutcracker which i love i was gonna add something over here but i forgot what that was i think i was gonna add a fireplace but i decided to add it in here i think it looks a lot more cozy and yeah and now we're going to move on to the upstairs oh my god i love it already it's so christmassy so over here when you first walk upstairs as you can see there is a gingerbread man and santa claus i finally have santa claus i didn't put that many um santa claus um like decorations and then i also have the jumbo and the mini nutcracker guarding the fan art room so that nobody goes ahead and changes the decals it's like the father and the son nutcracker so so cute i couldn't decide on the color so i just went with that blue and red and over here i have another snowman and another gingerbread man and i actually finally have an actual christmas tree i'm probably going to end up changing this because again i just don't like the way that the christmas tree looks in my house i don't know why but i decided to put it here in the corner there's a few presents underneath the christmas tree a few more decorations and i think that's it for that so we're gonna check out this room now 
I didn't add that many decorations to this room and I swear I deleted that, but apparently I didn't. The wreaths just don't look that good on my house or in my house, so I'm probably gonna end up deleting that. I didn't really add anything to this room, so that's kind of boring, but I'll probably add some other stuff off camera. So I have a stocking here. I just have a wreath and a gingerbread man. Moving on to the next room. The next room is over here and I added a lot more decorations to this room because this is my room and I use it the most so I decided to why not just, I don't know, why not just um, decorate it a little bit more. So I have a winter snow globe over here, a beautiful snowman, I have a gingerbread man. I also added another one of these Christmas trees but the mini version, I added the bigger one um, downstairs and the miniature version over there. So I think that's it for that room. I really like that one. And then in here, we have this. I didn't really add anything. The only thing I added was a snowman. That's all I added to the bathroom. That doesn't need to be super decorated. So that's that. And then one of the last rooms is in here. I didn't add anything to this room, which I probably should have, but I'll do that after. So yeah. That will be in the future um well when i mean the future i mean like literally right after i'm done making this video um and then i also added a snow globe but yeah this is the laundry room and i think that's basically it for the house at one point i just kind of went with the flow and i just started adding things um but yeah so this is what my house looks like i honestly love it and i think that's gonna be it for today's video maybe we can head down to the ice rink and skate a little bit because and then we could just end the video off there and now we're going to go to the ice rink let's hope that we get blue or pink skates okay so let's see what we get Ooh, purple for some reason every time i go on the ice i'm super slow okay i guess i'll just stick with this because i can't find the other blue this is more like a teal but we're just going ice skating let's spin yes fabulous let's go ahead and spin and jump at the same time <gasps> so cool I'm gonna do that one more time. That looked actually so cool. Okay, three, two, one, go! <laughs> so anyways, that's gonna be it for today's video. I had so much fun decorating my house for Christmas on Bloxburg, and I hope to do more decorating soon. That's kind of just what I had for now, and I didn't want to go all out because I don't want to have a super crowded house, but I definitely... Um, I do look forward to touring some of your Christmas builds. So thank you all so much for watching. Um, if you enjoyed today's video, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Bye, guys.